It is oddly freeing to have no dialogue to have to follow. And they just let their imagination go. And I gotta say, the actors that we brought in, they were just really great sports about it because you have to really surrender to the process and just be willing to make yourself look foolish. <laughs> that was so unladylike. <laughs> Being a voiceover actor represents a series of unique challenges because you are in a booth with a microphone in front of you and a director on the other side of the glass telling you what to do and you're putting your voice literally over picture. That was great, man. It's acting is what it is at its core. And um, it's about bringing the words and the story to life with your voice. <laughs> People who watch The Clone Wars every week uh, have really gotten to know these characters, uh, uh, Anakin Skywalker and Obi-Wan Kenobi and, and all of the clone troopers and Ahsoka Tano. And we fall in love with these characters and, and they've really endeared themselves to us. And so getting the opportunity to play them uh, in Lego Star Wars 3 The Clone Wars, it's, it's, this, it's this fun spin. You're seeing them in a way that you've never got to see them before. You hear us every week on, on The Clone Wars. Um, and you get to know these voices, and you get to know these characters with this voice. And it's going to be fun for fans of Star Wars and fans of the Clone Wars to actually hear the real cast. It's just, it's just a wackier version of what we normally do, that fans don't, you don't normally get to see that. <laughs> That's just goofy. <laughs> so Lego Star Wars 3 The Clone Wars uh, takes you all the way through the first two seasons of the Clone Wars animated series. So you get to go through these incredible uh, episodes, um, but just Lego style. I mean, it is definitely the biggest Lego Star Wars title to date, without a doubt. You feel like you're going back into the show, and the spirit of the characters, it crosses over from the show to the game. Always in time to save your life, Sky Guy. Thanks, Snips. <laughs> it's great fun to go back through um, numerous key episodes that you've seen in the series <laughs> and to work through them as these Legos characters with a slightly off-kilter, uh, kind of loopier take on it. I think it's just a good time. It's one of those games where you don't really have to think. You just turn it on, you have fun, you play. This is where the fun begins. You shoot some droids, you, you, you know, swing the lightsaber around, and you can play as your favorite characters from, from Star Wars history. If you're a fan of the LEGO universe, if you're a fan of Star Wars, you get to go in, have this great time, experience great gameplay, and you get to have a lot of laughs along the way.